Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe Show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Hey, no, welcome to the Valder BB Show. How are you this morning? Thank you. I'm very well. How are you? I'm fine. I want my audience to remember after two years, yes, been that long of the pandemic-related restrictions and cancellations, you as Americans, you guys are ready to travel. So in the studio, I've got Chief Marketing Officer for Travel Port, Jen Cato. She's a travel expert, and she's here on the Valder BB Show to discuss trends and insights and they've even done a recent survey to explain to us. Jen, that's a lot for you to do in this short time, so I'm going to try to get on with it. Tell me how much of a rebound has the U.S. travel industry experienced over the last few difficult years? Well, it has been a challenging two-plus years, but I'm really happy to say that by the end of this year, the global travel industry recovered by about 50% and is on track to recover by about 85%. And that's not just great news because it's fun to travel, which, of course, it is, but that's great news for the economy because one in 10 jobs globally is attributed to travel. So really happy to see that part of the recovery return. Tell me about the top destinations internationally and domestically that people are just want to travel to. We are seeing some really interesting destinations pop up at Travel Port. So let's start with international. You know, it's a mix of sun and sand and cultural capitals. Topping in at number one is Cancun, and there are a number of other Caribbean destinations like Punta Cana and Montego Bay on that list. But in a close number two is London, a very different destination, but with lots of those activities like museums and great restaurants that we've all missed out on these past few years. And now if we talk about domestic, we were a little surprised and excited to see that Seattle is in the number one spot. Summer is a great time to go there, beautiful weather. And Orlando, which was in the number five spot pre-pandemic, has bumped up to number two because everyone is ready to get back to those Disney vacations. It's a clear signal to us that families feel more comfortable doing that this summer, real surge in bookings there, and lots of great American cities on that list, San Francisco, LA, Chicago, really, really ready to get out and go. All right. So... London, my favorite spot you mentioned. I love London. Let me tell you, that's a great trip for someone to take. Okay, who is expected to do the majority of traveling this summer then? We are seeing at Travelport about 40% of those bookings are for families. And again, if you think about last summer, you know, as a mom of young kids, I, I can feel this personally. We weren't able to take international trips last year because our kids weren't vaccinated in time. Well, this summer is very different. We're seeing a lot of families take to the skies, both in the States and internationally. How can someone, before I get to that, let me take this one, this question off of Instagram. The traveler wants to know they love to travel by train. Is this still an option in America? Absolutely. In fact, I did a terrific rail trip up the California coast, went all the way up to that number one spot, Seattle. So that's a great trip to do. And you can do that here or you can do that on your rail. Lots of different options if you're a rail traveler. All right. Finally, as I wrap up, how can someone travel and explore with travel port then? Well, the good news is you probably already are and don't even know it because our technology powers hundreds of thousands of bookings. So if you're working with a travel agent or a booking app or using any other booking tools, we are probably powering your experience already. And Travelport, how do they make that connection? What's online for them? I would check out Travelport.com. We do have our summer survey. You'll see what American travelers are willing to give up this summer, including new clothes and restaurants just to travel. Jim, Jen, thank you so very much. I'm ready to take a vacation already, but I got to wait till um, Memorial Day. But thank you so very much for inspiring me and my audience on the Valder BB Show. Thank you. I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB Show, broadcast on radio and television. And this is 
my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.